story we've been following for months, the governor's demand to cut those property tax bills by 40%. And now a bill that aims to provide that relief has reached the floor. So we wanted to check in with some local business owners about what increasing sales taxes might mean for them. 1011's John Grinvald joins us live from the Capitol this evening where state senators are debating that bill right now. Madison Cole, senators have been going back and forth on the legislative floor for the last hour and a half. And as the clock ticks down on this short legislative session, one major sticking point is shifting a lot of the burden to sales taxes. It's a move that has many business owners raising the alarm. Balancing the Nebraska, the stool of the Nebraska tax base. That's what some state senators say this new property tax relief package is all about. LB 388 could raise sales tax as high as 1%. But for some business owners in town, it's the specific excise hikes that especially makes for an uncertain future. One component in the bill would see all CBD and hemp products taxed at 100%, something which Grateful Green owner Sarah Linden says could kill the industry. A lot of our guests are like lower to middle income, like hard working folks who like are living paycheck to paycheck. They can't really afford to pay twice as much for these products. And many of them are using them for to treat their medical ailments. And some owners say another tax, 20% on games of skill in the state, would cut down on major sources of revenue for restaurants, gas stations and other spots. Those owners tell me they hope the legislature steers away from those hikes. Now, it's important to stress that when this bill came out of committee last week, senators told me that not all the proposals inside it are perfect and that they'll likely tinker with them on the floor. So we'll continue to follow that as they do in the coming days. Reporting live in the Capitol, John Grinvalds, 1011 News.